That's Step what back you're not vehicle. going to do. That's what you're not going to do. You better. Ow! Ah, leave him, leave him, leave him. Tofer, can you repeat the location one more time? Two seven nine, Anaheim Drive, Yellow Jack. Tofer, maybe I'll I'll be in route. <coughs> Alright, we're gonna go out to this uh, request here. He's a 32 by the Yellow Jack, so. Gonna head out there, code 2, see what's, what, what's up over here. And uh, let's see what happens when we pull up. No need to go too f fast here. I might actually just turn my lights off. I'm not going that fast. We'll get there in a couple of seconds here. We'll go around this this vehicle. Alright, that car is turning. I don't know if he's he's actually at the yellow jack, okay. One out of one, you can show me 1023. Alright, let's get out and see what's up over here. I do need to save this car real quick. And then let's do that. And then let's get our walking style going. Because I don't think I set that up yet. No, I did not. Alright, let's go up here and see what's going on. Double the speed limit over the line, so you can kind of see where my problem is with that. So, you definitely quick, you see the your, problem with that. Yeah, you got your license, registration, insurance on you. Oh, <coughs> uh, yeah, let me go ahead and grab my registration from the glove box. Let me set this beer down real quick. Okay. Is there anything right, you don't mind if I go ahead about? and get to the glove box? Oh, uh, no, yeah, sir, can... nothing in the vehicle. Okay. Yeah, you can grab it from the glove box. Alright, thank you, sir. So, yeah, um, I was sitting over there at the gas station 277. And he mm -hmm. flew by me 78 to 40. Okay. Um, he was across the double yellow lines into the opposite lanes. Um, I pulled out. He he blew into here, parked right here. And, like, I flashed my lights and my siren. He just got out and walked inside. Okay. That's I'm, why I called you over here. And now he's drinking. Yeah, he, he just bought that when he came back out. So. Okay. You go inside him? <clears throat> for that, um, I'm gonna sign him for the speed and him over the line for sure. Mm -hmm. um, for the drinking, I'll probably, I don't know, one beer isn't strongly, to, you know, strongly advise him not to drink excessively oh, yeah. and then drive. Right, but yeah, I'll, I'll definitely sign him for the speed and everything. I mean, if it's five or ten over, that's one thing. But he was doing way too much. Twenty-eight. Yeah. So. All right, sir. Here you go. All right. <clears throat> I'm gonna go back to my car real quick. Just stand here with this officer right here. Okay, I'll be right back. All right, yes, sir. All right. All right so what you up to today, sir? Nothing much, man. Just getting off of work. Been a long day. In a rush to get to the bar and have a beer or two. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, what you working, dude? In construction. Construction? Is something, uh, something being built around here? Uh, no, I'm just doing some work for some... Uh, Intro people. Okay. All right. Interesting. Just small little patio projects and stuff like that. So that's so that's what you do. You just do you do some small little patio projects, or do you do like bigger projects from time to time? From time, I like to do actual bigger projects. So there's more profit in it, but it's mostly ninety percent residential work. Okay. So is it like building up the patios, or is it just like repair and stuff like that? 
Uh, anything to do with concrete. If, uh, let's say they wanted this whole driveway done concrete, I would tear out this and uh, go ahead and replace it with concrete, form it up and all that good stuff. Okay, interesting. So how, how, how long have you been doing this? About four years, legally. So you're saying you did it illegally before? Oh, uh, well, I used to do like uh, handyman work without a without a contractor's license. You know what I mean? But okay. then I eventually I had to get one. Okay, so been known this for yeah about four years. It sounds like a decent amount of time. Are you like, um, are you just doing it on your own? Is self self employment or are you doing it with a larger company, etc.? Uh no, yeah, I'm on, I'm the sole sole proprietor. Okay. So, so how do you kind of go about getting your clients and stuff like that? Uh, advertisement, lots of advertisement through Life Invader stuff like that. So, just advertising Life Invader, like how how's that been working out for you? You've been getting a lot of people come through. Uh, you know what? Um, on Life Invader, you know it's a, the residential people are a little cheap, so you know you gotta drop your prices down for them. Okay, so you put the prices down up there. So, have you been getting a lot of customers, or is it just a uh, uh, normal, you know, normal flow. Of people. It's a little slow right now. I ain't gonna lie. It's a little slow. Okay. So you looking to do anything other than just the construction, or is it just the construction stuff? Nah, yeah, just construction, man. I mean, I paid for the license, so might as well stick to it. Okay, that makes sense. So where where are you coming from? Well, other than you said work, but where where are you where are you going to later? Later on, I'm probably going to be headed over to Great Seed. I got a friend over there in Great Seed around like 096 area. Okay. All right. Well, I, I'm I'm going to strongly advise you don't drink and then, you know, heavily drink and then go ahead and drive. You know, that kind of stuff can get very, very dangerous. I've see, already seen you had a beer. Um, you know, try not to get too intoxicated because then obviously if you're over the legal limit and we catch you, you know, that's an issue. And it could cause an accident oh, yeah. and stuff like that. So just letting no, you know, I'm, I'm pretty lightweight. It's just one and done for me. Okay. As long as you're not like super drunk and going out on the road, I obviously I won't want you to be drinking at all and then driving, but you know, there's laws for a reason. So of course, of course. Yeah. I'm going to hang out here for a little bit, shoot some pool, maybe listen to the jukebox a little bit, let this buzz wear off. Yeah, I heard the um the officer told um caught you speeding and stuff. Like, well, what's the reason for all the speed and everything? Uh, you know what, man? I was just I was after it was after work. I was coming in from the city down in there in San Andreas, and uh, you know, traffic was killer all the way up here, and mm -hmm. I you know, I was just over it, so I was just trying to get here. Okay. Well, I, again, the speed speed limits are here for a reason. It's to protect you and everybody else around. If you're speeding and you lose control of that vehicle, that vehicle then becomes a weapon. You know that, right? Yeah, of course. You know, sometimes it just slips my mind. I apologize. Yeah, so just just be careful of that. Um, the officer will be will be back up here with you shortly. He just wants you to just just hang out over here somewhere, and um, we'll get you out of here as quickly as possible. Alrighty, boss. I'll go ahead and take a seat on the curb over here. All right, no problem. Alrighty, he's gonna just have a seat on the curb there, and the officer's coming back. Conversation ran pretty well. I hope that that didn't sound pretty awkward, you know. Alrighty, Mr. Bentley. Yes, sir. <laughs> here is your information back. Uh, Thank real you. Quick, do you have a license or a gun on you? Uh, you know what? Take my trolley. No, I don't actually. I left it at home. I don't. I don't take it to work with me. Okay. Only reason I was asking because you had a weapons license on your profile, so I was just making sure you didn't have it on you. Oh yeah. No, sir. All right. Patrol. So here's the deal. Um, what I'm gonna do is I have two tickets in my hand right here. One's for the speed. One is for the maintaining lanes because you were over the WL lines. Um, the speed. In terms of that, I could take it much higher. It could be a much larger charge, but I'm going to cut you a break today. And if it happens again, though, it won't be so much of a break, okay? So what I'm going to uh, have yes, you sir. do, I'm going to have you sign these two citations. What that means is it does not mean you're guilty. It just means that you are acknowledging that I have given you these tickets and that you have signed them and read them over, okay? Yes, sir. All right. So here's the two tickets, if you want to sign those real quick. 
All right, boss. Here you go. All right. So this is your copy. I'll have another copy in my computer system. Um, so just Thank you. make sure next time you slow it down. Make sure you're in your lane because you know if you if someone was turning out on that road and you were in the opposite lane, you could have hit them and it would cause a pretty bad accident. Yes, sir. I understand. Okay. I apologize. All right. I can understand being in a rush, but just make sure you slow it down, okay? Yes, sir. And then with your drinking, just make sure you know you're you're plenty okay to drive. You don't have too much, okay? Yes, sir. No, I'm going to hang out here for a bit. All right. So if you have any more questions, then you are free to go then. All right. Thank you. I appreciate it, man. Good night. All right. You too. Have a nice day. You too. User disconnected from your channel. Okay. Thanks for the backup. All right. No problem. One out of one. You can show me back today. All right, that's a pretty good stop. We're going to go ahead out now, head back to our juice station and uh certified in DUA. I can't understand what you're saying. One zero to one one. Traffic stop. Route one three. One zero zero. What's the code? <laughs> Alright, we got a DUA request right now. Show me 23. One out of one. So, whiskey. Okay, how much uh, glasses? About three or four. Three or four. Okay. Okay, well, do me a favor. Sit tight for a second. I'm going to go and uh, we'll get a thing squared away. Stand right there. Don't. Um. He's basically going no down northbound. He passed me. Um, I didn't clock him. I thought he was going at higher rates of speed. I flip around um, to try to see if I could clock him. Uh, he was going to speed limit. Uh, once I get to the point where a little bit before Joshua Road, across the Joshua Road intersection, he mm -hmm. uh, was on the turn He's lane, basically channel, going towards down. Joshua Road, but he did not. He Security continued guard, straight I'll, I'll and continued up, uh, on... Uh, Continued on driving on the uh, shoulder on the uh, right side, and then was you mean right here in his lane, and then not uh, no no on the right. You mean or, on no left? Sorry, Jeez, left side me. over there. Okay. Yes, left side. On the left side, he was swerving between the left side of the uh, road and then the uh, lane. Okay. If that makes any sense. Um, and then basically, as okay. he got out of the vehicle, he's you know bye bye. he looks drunk. Uh, he stated that he did have some uh, couple of beers, or not beers, whiskey. Uh, he said four cups, four glasses, whatever. Yeah, I was on a stop with him earlier, and uh, he had a beer when, well, when we were right there. And we told him not to drink so much, but I guess he didn't listen. So we're gonna, yeah. I'm going to test him, okay? Um, yeah. Let me just get my kid out of my car. Yep, you do what you need to do. I'm going to go and run his information. Okay. Okay, sit tight, Mr. Uh, Charles. If you want to go ahead and just lean on the, the front of my cop car so you don't fall down or anything. Yes, sir. Okay, sir. Hello? Yes, sir. Alright, good day. I'm going to commission Marshall with the uh, 
Los Santos Corrections Sonora Valley Police Department. Um, today I'll be doing uh, some fuel sobriety tests with you to make sure that you're okay to be driving. You understand that? Yes, sir. Okay. We're going to be going through three tests. The first one is going to be a DUI test. Well, not the first one. That's the last one. The, f the first one is going to be the horizontal and vertical gaze nystagmus. The second one is going to be the one leg stand. And then the other one, the last one, is going to be a breathalyzer test. Do you uh, refuse to do any of these tests? Oh, uh, you know what, man? I'll, no, I'll go ahead and do it for you, man. Okay. The second question I have for you. Are you on any prescription medication? Uh, no, no prescription medication. Do you have any disabilities? Uh, no, sir. Okay. Then you are perfectly able to perform these tests, correct? Uh, yes, sir. All right, the first one is going to be the horizontal and vertical gaze nystagmus. What I'm going to do, I'm going to have a pen right here. It's going to have a little bit of a light on the end of it. It's nothing to blind you, okay? What I need you to do, you're going to follow this pen with your eyes only and not your head. Do not move your head. Do you understand that? Yes, sir. Are you ready to complete the test? Yes, sir. I see any movement and is his eye smooth or tricky? Alright. Alright, just follow the pen. He's going to be answering the uh, thing here. <coughs> okay. All right. Next test, sir. Next test is going to be the one leg stand. What I need you to do, you're going to raise your... Which foot is your dominant foot? Right leg. Your what? My right leg. Okay, so you're going to raise your left leg approximately six inches in the air. You're going to um, look down at your toes, and then I need you to Is count from 1-1000 one, one to 5-1000. You understand that? Yes, sir. Okay. Go ahead and do that when you're ready. Okay, sir. one one thousand, one thousand. Three one thousand, four one thousand, five one thousand, six one thousand, seven one thousand, eight one thousand, nine one ten one thousand. So what we're looking for here is if he has any balance issues or serious speech. People that are intoxicated, their head is usually pretty much spinning. So they have an issue with standing on one foot and, and um, you know, carrying out the test properly. Even doing that multi um, multitasking. He's serious speech and unstable. So he's definitely drunk. I'm going to do the last test. All right. So the, la the final test is going to be the um the breathalyzer test i have this little machine here which i'm going to need you to blow into you're going to blow into this tube blow as hard as you can and until i tell you to stop once i tell you to stop then um i will take your reading and then we'll go from there do you understand that yes sir all right i'm gonna get the machine out here all right slash b a c c all right you ready sir Yes, sir. All right, you can go ahead and start blowing. Zero point seven two. Okay. User left your channel. All right, thank you. Go ahead and sit tight for me. 
Do not move. Yes, sir. All right, trooper. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm gonna. So I did the test. He passed one of the three. Okay. Um, the one that he tested, the pass was the breathalyzer test. He blew a 0.72. I highly recommend you don't let him drive the vehicle. Um, if you're gonna cite him, you can cite him for the um, for the driving under the influence and let him go. But uh, because it's not over the legal limit, we can't. I, I don't. I I wouldn't suggest arresting him. Okay. But he blew a wait 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 wait, wait. hold on. That's way over the limit. I'm just going to make sure that's what he meant. All right, sir, go ahead and turn around, put your arm behind your back for me. You're going to be under right, arrest right, for man. driving while under the influence. You understand that? Oh, uh, yes. Do you yes, have anything? Sir. Do you have anything on your pull me stick mirror, me, sir? No, not that I'm aware of. All right, I'm going to just patch you down real quick. Make sure you don't have anything else on you, okay? Yeah, he's drunk drunk. 0 0.072 is like almost deaf to be quite honest. That is <laughs> exactly That's wait. I I just realized what it, what uh, I was talking about when I when I said it. Just watch your head, sir. Okay. I just uh, got his yeah, wallet. Yeah, I was writing his arrest for anyways in the middle of the fall on that cuz I I'm, I assumed that he was very drunk. Yeah, he's he's drunk, but at first, when I read it, it was like, he's on the limit. But then I looked back and was like, wait, 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 wait. pause. Hold on. 0 0.72? That nah, was way too high. So then, yeah. All right. So I did a test. He blew 0 0.72. You can put that on your report. Um, he failed all three tests. Then he failed the horizontal and vertical um, gaze nystagmus. The... Uh, one leg stand and then the breathalyzer test. I'm gonna go ahead and search okay. his vehicle, see User what's in here. One out of one. Can I get a, a tow out here to yes, post a code 100 to North Freeway okay, for a right, uh, green color ramp? Yes, sir. We also have one ten fifteen. We told this guy not to drive. He still drove. User entered your channel. Yeah, I reckon. I really, I hate people that like, I not hate, but I don't like when people are driving because you're you're not driving when while talking. You will have county tow on route. Endangering your life, but you're endangering other people's lives, and that's not good. So, you already have a criminal, or you already have a history with, uh, you've already been arrested for one time for the, uh, driving under the influence. Obviously, it's gonna be a second time. Yeah, um, amazing. So, I don't know what the judge is gonna decide. I don't know how, I'm surprised that your, your license right. wasn't maybe suspended for the time being. Find a bottle. Bottle of beer and a few empty ones in the back seat. Um, but you know, that is you know what? Time, I think so. it's I think it's two or three strikes and you're out with the license. I'm not sure. Well, I'll go ahead and review that. All right, I found a couple more beer bottles. Uh, one that's open, and then there's a few in the back. I'm just gonna go back and count it and see how much it is. Okay. User joined your channel. Uh. 
All right, looks like he had about five, and uh, he was drinking a sixth one, and you pulled him over. Okay. I called to already, so we can get the truck out of here, and then you'll be good to go. Yep. One out of one can show uh, me okay, detaching well, I appreciate from this it. Stay call. Stay safe out there. Post a call, Andrew. All right, no problem. You too. We got one ten fifteen. Uh, trooper will be with him ten sixty five shortly. All right, that was a pretty good call. Hope you guys enjoy that. Let's go and continue and see what's going on. Vehicle over here at uh, 260 Route 68. Dispatch. Panorama Drive. 277. Vehicle is going to be stopped at this time. Uh, 260 Route 68. I need additional. And for Control to 7 Charlie 02, you copy Adam 1's traffic. Four copy. All right, good day, sir. Good day. Good day. Gonna be Commissioner Marshall with the uh, Commissioner Marshall with the North Valley Police Department. Reason for the stop is one, you just reverse straight out of there, maxing to the road and smash your car over here. And we also hold on, give me a second. What'd you say? Sorry. Do you have the vehicle stop? Time for this vehicle is gonna be an orange and color BMW. No, um, it's gonna be a convertible. Can you get with the DOT uh, member and give a description of the vehicle again? 10 4, control to 235. Can you advise item 1 of the vehicle description? 10 4, it's a orange BMW with no roof. 10 4, I got that vehicle. Vehicle is going to be WWE Whiskey Whiskey Echo. Alright. Sorry about that. I had to talk to the radio. No problem. Now, can you can you go ahead and acknowledge me? <sighs> okay. Right. Acknowledge. So that's why that's why you pulled all in the back of traffic like that because you want people to ignore no. all of you. No, I have a heavy foot and it got stuck on the reverse. Okay. Total one on one. Do you want a roll back on the vehicle? Ten four. All right. Do you got any license or registration proof insurance? Your vehicle is How long would this take? I have rest and practice. It'll take as long as it can it take, because you uh, under the name you got an accusation Roman. against you hitting somebody's vehicle with a baseball bat. So say that what? again. Why would I ever do such a thing? Your vehicle comes back clean and clear, registered to Roman Rain. He does have a prior for evading a police officer, battery, and a couple other charges. Ten four. All right. Thank you. You got any baseball bats in your vehicle, sir? 
No, sir, I do not. Oh, okay. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> this character is crazy. At four. Control to Adam one. Would you like me to route you another unit? Uh, driver's being pretty compliant for now. Let me look at this vandalism. Sir, step back in your car. Sir. I need to stretch before practice. Step back in your car, sir. I need to stretch. Sir, step back in your car. I need to stretch. I'm not going to ask you again. If I pull a hamstring, that's on you. Uh, uh, one item one. If you need backup, I am just run the corner. Don't worry. I need to find the legal code real quick because I need to find vandalism. I want to know if Control it's something. Five, five, David, three two six. Is your ten eleven and ten sixty five code four? Mm, penal code. Control F Vandalism. It's a misdemeanor. <coughs> one out of one. Can I get a unit to come down here with this tow driver and assess the damage on the truck? All right, what's this deal about you okay, hitting the, the tow truck driver's vehicle with your back? I have no clue, sir. You have no clue what is what what he's saying, so you tell me that he's lying. I'm telling you, I don't know what he's talking about. Okay. I mean, he made a pretty serious accusation against you, so. And that has nothing to do with me. I mean, my stature, my. My uh, my popularity. I mean, everybody says I yeah, did something I to them. I don't really care about what your popularity is. I just want to figure out what this is. Okay. And I just I just want to get to practice. Okay, our practice. Um. All right. Here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna cite you for the vandalism. Um, and we also vandalism go, citation. What? Yes, I'm gonna cite you for the vandalism. Acknowledge me. No, I will what? not. <laughs> I'm gonna cite you for the vandalism. So That's step back in your vehicle. That's what you're not going to do. That's step what you're not vehicle. going to do. That's what you're not going to do. You better. That's what you're Ow! Not going to do. Nah, leave me. him. Leave him. Leave him. Acknowledge me. One out of thirty-five. The guy in the orange BMW. The you better punch him. One out of one. Ten eighty. Ten eighty. Ten eighty. Zero, zero, oh, he's lucky. Control calling to Oh, his driving is horrible. Are we gonna move to that blue color? One out of one, all units pause the uh, civilian crash. User disconnected from your channel. Alright, one out of one, the uh, pursuit is continuing. Oh shit. I looked down for one second. Road 
Charles 7 Charlie 102, you're attached. Jesus Christ, driving. Charlie 396, 396 on Columbia Road. Continuing southbound. Going to be taking east right now heading westbound on Southbound Drive, 397, 397. Holy Subject shit. Subject went down, 1050. 397, 1050. Stand by, disregard, continuing on. Stand by, getting out of the vehicle, 1070, 1070, heading north, northbound, down about in 397. Don't move, man. Don't move, man. Don't move. Jesus Christ. I don't know how that got in you, but okay. Jesus, I don't know. Why am I? Why am I getting? What? <laughs> what are you? Get doing? on the ground! <laughs> I'm Brock Lesnar, boy. <laughs> I'm in the tribal chief. Ow! Uh, my apologies. I got him grabbed. Stop relax, moving. relax. Ah. I got him. I got him. I got him. All I right. I am the tribal chief. Oh my gosh. Uh, this is crazy. Can't handle me. Stop no. Not handle me. No. Acknowledge me. No. No. me. I'm Brock. <laughs> I'm your daddy. Okay. You got anything on you? Put me sticking me or hurt me, sir. I got to repeat on no. that address. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you say and do can be used against you in the court of law. You have the right to have an attorney present during questioning. If you can't afford one, one will be appointed to the state sanctuary. So your son's rights have right to today. That was a short I need bro. my manager. I need my agent. I need my lawyer. Okay. <clears throat> I was not bringing my Where's my tribal now. clan? Tribal clan unite. You mean the, you mean the bloodline? Right. The bloodline, yes! That's how I know you're delusional, because you don't even know who Dura Marines is. It's crazy. Acknowledge me! No. Yeah, I think I got a couple broken ribs. Man, it hurts to breathe, but... All right, just lay down for me. You need, you need, uh, let's have you lay down, all right, man? You shouldn't have even gotten out of the car. Yeah, thanks for hitting me with right. a baton twice. Uh, my apologies, okay? On my side, it did not look like that. I apologize. Yeah, it's okay. A lot of weirdness have been happening recently. I know, man. Control units on scene. Do you have a, uh, you know, injuries on the officer? Uh, he's claiming to have probably a couple broken ribs. Uh, we're assessing him now. All right, let me just assess you real quick. All right. All right, go ahead and do that. I'm going to take the suspect down. All right. Let me out of this cage. That's crazy. That's What the f? One other one can show me ten sixty five. <clears throat> one other one. Can I get one of the units to search his car? Okay. 
I'll uh, take him to the new SASB station. Control unit on scene, EMS responding. Yeah, board, you going to get it? Stand by. I probably should have waited for EMS to come to get his uh, pager problems out, but yeah, it is what it is. You get f uh, family, even in arrest, and battery and law enforcement officers at times two. No, three. He, he tackled three units, so. Control 7, Charlie 130. They are 1.5 out. 10 4, thank you. And, um, there yeah. are things you don't do in your life. You don't tug on Superman's cape. You mean like assault law enforcement officers? One day, all of your hard work will not pay off. Only Roman will overachieve. Okay. Oh, I guess you ended up like in... Well, let me not say that, actually. I don't care how many there are. I don't care how, how many you think you think you are. There's not a man standing in this county. They can stop me now. I mean, I just did. I tripped. <laughs> you tripped over a mountain. I tripped over a rock. Answer your skybox. Sure. Let's go with that. All right, this is a new SASB station. I know we're just using it for the sake of it right now. Let's see if this is my car. This is my yard now. Put me in the cage. I bet you I'll rumble out of here. Right. Okay. Need to be out of here before LA starts. Uh huh. Before my flight to LA leaves. Uh huh. A big fight right. to fight. In here. And you're going to make a right once you get in. <laughs> Ow. All right. When I get him, I'm going to beat your butt, bro. Take me in here now. Put me in the cage. Just like bro, Brock Lesnar did to you at WrestleMania. Ah. You better get, you better start assaulting me, man. That's time four now. Get up. Get inside. He's right now preoccupied. Down the stairs. What's wrong with you? Gonna give you that Brock Lesnar treatment. Get out of here, hat man. Yo, stop yelling, bro. You ain't no Roman Reigns. I'd be advised he's putting getting put in the you cell. See these muscles? Going to the cell. Turn on. And answer your skybox. He is being placed into a cell. He might be answering in a few seconds. User joined your channel. One out of one. He answered, but he answered in OLC. He's in OLC, sir. They can't see that. Whoops. Officer, so I go my play times. Control direct to four. 7 Charlie 130, copy. Yeah, you see it? 7 Charlie 130 to add one out of one. Be advised. I seem to see a legal document stating a legal name change in the subject's vehicle. Uh, Not sure what name he gave you. Time for he's uh, imitating a WWE wrestler. 
And you found, did you find a bat in the car? Accused of... I see an ID of Roman Reigns, a bat, and a legal document stating a legal name change. Vandalizing a... Getting bagging these up for evidence and taking them to you. 10-4, I'm at the uh, State Patrol Station on 26C. Accused of vandalizing a, a DOT truck under in after being stopped and questioned. The driver then proceeded to assault law enforcement and attempted to flee in his car which turns into him crashing all right that was a pretty good scene hope you guys enjoy that let's head back out today and uh yeah